welcome to Squiggle Dance 2. This is called the Wiggle. Now don't forget, don't let the adult leading the squiggle limit the movement. Very often as adults, when we say up, we're only lifting up to here. But in the wiggle, we need to lift right up as far as you can. And again, we need to go down with our wiggle as far as you possibly can. Hopefully that's quite low because the squiggler needs to be the bendy one. <laughs> okay, are you ready to wiggle? Again, we're going to wiggle upwards. And again, we're going to do that five times. One, two, three, four, five. Now, with really young children, I would break these dances up and try to get them stretching up five times before you get them to go right down. And then once you've gone down wiggling five times, you then need to go up and down in one continuous movement. Then we're going to wiggle to the side five times. One, two, three, four, five. Well done. And then you're going to wiggle to this side. One, two, three, four, five. Can you see my exaggerated movement where I pull back? And the same in the crossover, arms out, okay? And wiggle them across each other. Very difficult to pull back wiggle. You can if you want, or you could just wiggle forwards and bring it back. Again, five times. In the continuous movement, you would go up to down continuously and down to up continuously. So you would do one, two, three, four, and five. To centre, turn to the side, you side wiggle in five times, you side wiggle in five times, and then you cross over wiggle. Once the movements are complete each time, go straight to your drawing. So if you're at the beginning of the dance, only do up wiggling. So take your crayons and up you go. Take your crayons and down you go. If you've done both, put them together, up to down up to down. 